back to Farawa. Today we are baking spring biscuit bread. It has been quite a while since we've baked something, so I figured it was about time, and to celebrate the first day of May, I crafted this bread. Well, I was missing many of the ingredients, so I had to substitute, and it turned into sort of a biscotti instead, but good all the same. Preheat the oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit. First, add 4 cups of flour to a large to medium bowl. Next, grind walnuts into a paste of 1 half cup. Then, grind half a cup of dried oats and add both of those in. Put in 1 teaspoon of almond extract, 1 half teaspoon of baking powder, 2 cups of white sugar, and 1 teaspoon of cinnamon. Plus 2 eggs, 3 fourths cup of plain Greek yogurt, and mix it all together. Once it is combined, it should be pretty doughy and sticky. Sprinkle out a lot of flour on the counter and start to knead the dough. If it is very sticky, add a fifth cup of flour and knead that in, which is what I ended up doing. Form the dough into a ball, or whatever shape you'd like, and place it on the baking pan to bake for about 40 minutes to an hour or once the top is a nice golden brown. Next, slice it into oval biscuits. You'll probably find the inside to be extremely doughy, but that is only because it is so dense. After you've cut your strips as thick as you deem fit, lay them on a baking tray and bake them at about 300 degrees Fahrenheit for perhaps another 40 minutes or until they are fully cooked. Let them cool and they shall crisp up to be hard like a biscuit. Just to make sure my recipe worked, I made it again for Mother's Day and it turned out pretty much the same. It goes great with butter, jam, fruit, honey, or any other toppings you'd like to add. Hope you enjoyed the video and let us know if you tried the recipe. Bye for now.